In preparation for Covington High School's upcoming play, Aida, dance instructor Holly Flatman brought in her longtime friend and Afro-Caribbean dance instructor Kelly White from New York City to teach her dance students. We are currently working on the play Aida, um, which has African roots and wanted to get the kids understanding that full body movement. Following an extensive warm-up, White pushed the dancers to their limit with an Afro-Caribbean dance boot camp. She pushed us to where even when we were tired, she kept pushing and making it to where it was fun to where you didn't want to stop. Even though your body wanted to like give up and you were tired, you just couldn't because you were having so much fun. It was fun. I never thought I'd be able to learn from a New York instructor, especially in Afro-Caribbean. Shoulder, stack. But while Afro-Caribbean dance is fun and full of cardio Shoulder, and new techniques, stack. White says it's also important for students to learn the origins and cultural significance of the style. Afro-Caribbean dance styles are important because of the contribution it has to Western world dance. The history, the folklore, also the movement all, all informs a lot of the modern dance chore choreographers nowadays. So we, what we have now is this big fusion happening. And as a dancer, you have to be versatile. You have to be able to carry anything that's being thrown at you. And it's those new experiences and the promotion of versatility that Flatman hopes to use to reach her goal of excellence in the performing arts at Covington High School. Walk, 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 e. Grant Yenny, Channel 13. Yep.